but for the joy of having finished the struggle, only to find that it's parts of the struggle you miss the most. Hey everyone, Dr. Jones here with another weekly message. And this week, I want to talk about the idea of the positives in the struggles we face day to day once we get through them. Now, you may wonder where this is coming from, but as I think about seniors finishing their school career at high school and going on to any step that they see as their next step towards success, be that college, the military, the workforce, anything they do, I want to stop and focus on the idea of how all these little steps, year by year, month by month, even day by day sometimes, added up to be something wonderful, spectacular, momentous, and yet at the same time, bring with it a sense of sorrow. Nothing too big, just a little sense of this time in my life is passing. And how is it that so many times when we're facing struggles or facing obstacles to get to our goals, that we think about how awful they are, and yet we never stop to think about the things that we've gained by going through them. The friendships, the meaningful relationships of support, camaraderie, and the idea that others may be facing struggles just like us and offering support to them as well. You see, how is it that oftentimes when we've met that goal, that sense of relief, that sense of elation even, that we've gotten there, we sometimes take a step and just reflect on what we'll miss by not being in that struggle. So when we do that, we're not to feel sorry. We're not to feel down. We're still to celebrate that success. But part of growing and part of continuing towards even greater successes is the idea of keeping those relationships, not feeling bad that they're moving on, but watering them much like we do a plant to nurture and grow them. And by that, I mean taking stock of who played what role and staying in touch, be it letters, phone calls, text messages, social media, anything like that. And most importantly, saying thank you, feeling grateful for the experience that you've had, feeling grateful for having gone through those struggles that have made you the success you are today. Sometimes the victory isn't the same victory without having gone through the struggle to attain it. Well, that's it for this week. Remember, reflect on your successes, but also reflect on your failures. But no matter what, use each to reframe your perspective to the positive and to gratitude. As always, be purposeful, act with integrity, and continue to build your character. You have a great week.